Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Master Luke here, and welcome back to Pokemon Shining Pearl. On the last episode, we finally made it to Snowpoint City, where we're ready to take on the Gym Leader. Um, before I do that, though, let's, uh, let's buff up our team a little bit, because, as you can see, our Pronita is only 37, so... I don't know what they are in there, but I don't want to get wrecked too hard. Um... So what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm just going to use the Metacham, but because we got rid of that in the last episode for this Gasper, or Haunter, or whatever you want to call it, which didn't evolve during the trade, um, ah, see this Metatite's only 13, that's not going to work. I was hoping I had some more, uh, fighting type Pokemon, but I don't. And my only ro <laughs> my rock type Pokemon is level 6. So, I guess we're going to have to do without. I don't think we, anybody knows any other moves, right? Is this... Ah, uh, the B-Girl's only 25. I'm like, it, if it knows ro uh, Rock Smash, but... Alright, never mind. I guess it looks like we're going to go in with Ponita, and all the fire moves, and Empoleon, and... Wha what is this steel move again? Oh, wait, no. Metal Claw, which does 50. And it's a physical attack, and uh, Empoleon's a special attacker. So we'll see how we'll see how well this goes, because that's our, like our only option. Hopefully, we can blaze this whole thing. <laughs> no pun intended. Blaze it with uh, Ponita, but we'll see. All right. Hey there, how's it going, Jump to be? Do you see the big snowballs placed in there? You need to slide on the ice with enough momentum to crush them. The gym leader is a user of ice-type Pokemon. Melt her defenses with scorching hot fire-type moves. It's all about uh, focus with this gym. Bear down and focus. Alright, I don't remember how to break any of these, so... Uh... Okay. Am I going the wrong way? Is that enough... Oh no, I, I know what you have to do. You gotta go down, yeah! That's the only way to get them, is, is by sliding down. Because I used to be able to think, oh, you could do it from, uh, like, the same, the same elevation? No. Alright, let's battle this guy first. It's too cold! I can't even feel my tongue! Bro, why are you in an ice-type gym, then? Ice Trainer Sergio. Starting with Floatzel. Alright. Well, that's not an Ice type Pokemon. And our Ponyta is about to get wrecked. So. Swap one out of here. About to send in a sneasel. Mm. Let's see if this works. Oh wait, no, it's dark. That's good against. Oh my god, I just messed up. I just insta mess. Okay. What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> uh, Alright. I botched that. Way to go. Alright. That was, that was trash. Hit him with the flame wheel! Oh my. That was fast. God, I don't know why. I, I don't know why I get those twisted in my head. Sometimes I remember it right, and then sometimes I'm like, I'm like, I know there's a connection there. You defeated an Ace Trainer, Sergio. It's cold, bitter cold. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. All right. 
Let's go down here. We got a, another ruddy battle. Is the gym's trick floor making you a little hot under the collar? If you can't maintain your cool in battle, you'll freeze up. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Savannah. And it's a teleport. They never start with ice type Pokemon. That's what I noticed. Like, so the Ace Trainers, you almost don't want Ponyta in the top spot because eventually they'll get there, but. All right, back to Luxray does. My goodness, I just feel so stupid with the Alakazam. Put him in just to go, oh, oh, yeah, whoops, my bad. No, 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 come back. <laughs> We're swapping you out again. God, when am I gonna remember what's what? I swear, guys, I get, I, I just have to play more Pokemon. I will beat it into my head until I can remember type advantages for sure. And I won't have to guess anymore. There we go. Uh, a Golduck. No, we'll just stick with Luxray. Oh. God dang it. Hopefully that's still enough. I don't know if it's actually part Psychic. I think it's just water, though. Yeah. Darn, I messed up again. I forgot that when a new... I always think, like, it, it sets you back to the beginning when it's a new Pokemon, but it's it's not. So. Are you serious? Is she the ground-type move? Uh, am I gonna get wrecked? It's, thir it's only 36. I don't even know. I mean, I guess this... Yeah, here, we'll use the Bolt Switch, because... It doesn't, oh, it doesn't uh, swap me out? I thought that was the whole thing. Volt switch, I guess only if it hits. All right, whatever. There it is. And we're finally level 50, look at that. Uh, a Steelix. This should one-shot it. Oh, of course not. Tell me it doesn't know Earthquake or something stupid like that. Screech. Okay. <laughs> and we and we still dodged. Brine. For that 100% kill. Kill confirm. Thank you. And we defeated Ace Trainer Savannah. You're surprisingly cool. At least I have my warm boots. Is this one we can slide down? Oh, it didn't. Okay. All right, let's battle this girl. Are you feeling the chill of fatigue? A good trainer uh, goes for the win, no matter what their condition is. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Alicia. All right. Hey, they finally started with the ice Pokemon. That's. That's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. One shot, one shot, one shot. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Tenacruel. Ooh. That was not something I was expecting to see in this gym. Uh, da -da -da. Hit him with another spark. Perfect.
And we defeated Ace Trainer Alicia. That's right, a good trainer will win no matter what the situation may be. Uh, do, nope. I've only been involved with Pokemon for a short time. I managed to get this far because, uh, skilled friends toughened me up. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Brina. And it's a snowbird. Time to get bowled over. That was bad, but I'm gonna go with it. <laughs> All right. All too easy. You defeated Ace Trainer Brina. And with that, I can't believe how tough you are. Uh, is this enough to... Yeah. Oh, and right into another battle. My willpower was shaped and tempered by howling blizzards. I'll bring it to... To bear on you. Oh, okay. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Isaiah. And you got a Quagsire. So this is where I'm gonna... Mm, if I do... Uh, that's gonna have no effect. Yeah. Oh, man, we're stuck with the Absorb again. Yawn. Oh, you're gonna put me to sleep immediately. Okay, well, that's perfect. Well, in that case... Uh, I'm gonna hit you with some Toxic. That way you're guaranteed a poison, so even if I fall asleep, you still take a damage every turn. That's right. Oh, he's trying to yawn again. Uh-uh. Oh, that's it? That's all the poison did? And, of course, I'm asleep. Uh... I'm just gonna switch to Star Raptor and... Seven hit combo this fool. With close combat. Oh, did I say seven? I mean 24. Come here, Quagsire. No, it does Ice Beam! No! Ah, uh, and we're. We're frozen? Really? I mean, I'm glad I got the poison. Oh, jeez. Come on, tell me this. No, we're still frozen. As he hits me with another ice beam. What a bad... Oh. What a bad move. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, well that's so much for my 20, 24, 30 hit combo, whatever. Alright, Alex Sam. We're gonna, we're gonna hit you with that future sight and just blow your mind couple turns. Alright, well that was... that didn't do anything. Actually, we don't even need to, probably. We can probably just, uh, where is it? Hit him with this and it should be enough. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Because he was already at half health, so it didn't really matter. And with that, we defeated Ace Trainer Isaiah. You weren't even phased. Nah, he actually, he actually got me pretty good there. Alright, uh... Go down to the middle. What else haven't I done yet? Oh, that's not enough there. Okay. Mm. Is it one down? Yep. Okay. Alright, so we can then go... Doo -doo -doo. Back this way. Is this not going to take this... Oh. My bad. Yeah, that's not going to take that out. Alright. Well, let's go straight down the middle. 
What? Oh, I guess the stairs count. Like, they, they slow you down. Well, that's a bummer. Okay, we can at least do this one, then. Because there's no stairs over here. Oh, jeez, that went way up high. We spend all our time battling in the blizzards of Snowpoint City. We'll show you how, uh, how it's toughened us up. <coughs> Man, excuse me. All right, Ace Trainer Anton. And it's a snowbird. Junior trainer that we have have yet to fight in this uh, in this gym. Nice and easy. What's with your toughness? Um, but do do. Cause I'm. Yep, we already we already battled them. Let's see. Can we do anything over here? No. Oh, come on. Hmm. Does this actually take me anywhere? Oh, ah, oh, crap. There. I should be able to get all the way back to the beginning. Yes. Now just go straight. Nope, there's because there's one more. Alright, this straight across. Oh, what? Oh, because, yeah, I guess because we slowed down. Okay, well now I now I don't know what to do. Cause that's obviously not enough to get those. Cause we'll lose too much speed. Dang, what do I do here? All right, we're gonna figure this out. And when we do, I'm gonna look like the world's biggest idiot because I couldn't, I couldn't figure it out earlier. Because uh, this one is blocked by the stairs. That would have that would have busted it, no? Oh, here we go. This is it. This is gotta be it, right? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Alright, now we now we got it. Go back to the beginning. Uh okay. We'll take the we'll take the long way. So I guess you're not supposed to hit all the uh, all the snowballs. There, now we got a straight path all the way through. Okay. You want to challenge Candace? Sure thing. I was waiting for someone tough, but I should tell you, I'm tough because I know how to focus. Pokemon, fashion, romance—it's all about focus. 
I'll show you just what I mean. Get ready to lose. All right, Candace. You are challenged by Gym Leader Candace. And she's gonna start with a snowbird. All right, here we go, Bonita. One level underneath me, so. Ah, perfect. And what is our next Pokemon? I'm just gonna throw out a Sneasel. Alright. Oh, we're really gonna try it. Also 38. And it used Dig. Of course it did. Bummer. Uh, all right. So for that, we're gonna switch to. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have to switch to Empoleon. Cause that's the only other. Well, no, because it's part. Steel. I don't even know if this is gonna work. We'll see. Yeah. Let him take the hit. Uh, yeah, Metal Claw. Here we go. We're quite a bit higher than this Sneasel. So, hopefully... Good! Alright, got a one-shot. Nice job, Napoleon. All right, and then it's Abomin Snow for the last one, I believe. Oh, Metacham. Oh, that's right, she has four Pokemon. Uh... Oh, still frozen. Well, it is. Yeah, well, this might work. Okay, better than what I was, I was picturing. Oh! All right, as long as we go first next turn, we should be okay. No, not not enough to for the hail to finish him off. Nice, another crit. Good job. All right, now the Obama Snow. I forgot she has four Pokemon. Not, I've, I've been so used to all the, the gym leaders up until this point, only having three. Uh, all right. We still got some health on this uh, Ponita. Let's see if, how much how much damage we can get get done before it perishes. Because I'm, I'm not holding out on this, this Ponita. I'm going to break the ice and bring out my last resort Pokemon. Obama! All right, it's level 42. But it is four times weak, so as long as we go first, we might be able to one-shot this. Oh, nope, not quite. Maze the berry. All right, stay alive for this turn, please. Use Blizzard. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. Oh, okay. It still killed me. All right. You did good, Ponita. I can sense your will to win, but I promise you, I'm not about to lose. Alright, pull up with some Metal Claw. See ya. And there goes the Abama Snow. You defeated Gym Leader Candace. I must say, I've warmed up to you. I might even admire you a little. Wow, you're great. You've earned my respect. I think your focus will, uh, and will bowl us over totally. Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to give you this. 
All right, only one more gym badge to go. You received the icicle badge from Candace. That icicle badge I just gave you. Because you have it, you can use the hidden uh, move rock climb from your Pokech. Oh, and take these too. We got the same stickers as Candace and TM72. TM72 contains the move Avalanche. The user takes, if the user takes damage, the move's power is doubled. Can you imagine what sort of focus you need to pull it off? All right, and with that, we've completed Snow Point City and the Ice Type Gym. Uh, let's go heal our Pokemon first, and now we gotta go save uh, Barry. That's the other reason we came up here. Because of the last Team Rocket, or Team Rocket, gosh. Team Galactic, uh, Lake Pokemon. Forgetting my words here. All right. Let's go stop Team Galactic before they, uh, they beat, up, beat up Barry too bad. That's not the way. You're here to see the lake Pokemon, too. You must be bored to fight your way through the snow to get here. The Pokemon of the three lakes appear to be connected somehow. When Lake Valor was blown up, a cavern appeared in the middle of this lake. Ah, you're not getting away with this, Team Galactic. Oh, are you finished already? Your Pokemon aren't bad, but you're laughably weak. You honestly thought you could save the Pokemon of the lake and become the Pokemon champion? Dream on, little kid. But ew, it's so cold here. Let's get back to the Veilstone HQ. Oh, don't I know you? We met in Eterna City. Listen, Team Galactic is going to do something huge for everyone's sake. That's why you should keep out of Team Galactic's way. Don't come whining about that poor Pokemon and other trivial junk like that. Don't waste your time coming to our HQ in Veilstone. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah, that's right. I couldn't do anything against Team Galactic. That Pokemon called Uxi, it was, it was suffering. I'm gonna get tougher. It's not about winning or losing. That's not good enough. I have to be stronger. Let's, uh, grab our Beeberl and do a little, do a little swimming, a little surfing. There's nothing inside the cavern yet. But I'm trying to remember, was there, I believe there was something over here. Oh. Well, wild Pokemon, that's for sure. And look, another Beeberl. Uh, but that's not what I needed. I thought there was an item. Or a TM, or something like that. Now nah, let's just run. Nope, it's just an empty slot. He's back. Back for more. But I won't let you have the satisfaction. Nope. Running away again. Oh, there it is. I'm like, I knew there was something up here. For my last playthrough. Another Sneasel. Yeah, this is a boy because it's got like a long... Ear? Is that an ear? I don't know. Yeah. And we got TM14 Blizzard. Just like that Obama Snowhead. Alright. Let's see. Back to the Veilstone HQ. Let's see. Uh, no, I don't need to swap out Pokemon. I think I don't. There. Would you look at those antenna? I don't know what they do, but those are some mighty impressive antenna. Hey, it's you. I bet you don't remember me, but I sure remember you. Because of you, they took my Clefairy away. My partner called it quits and back to, went back to his hometown. I don't know anything about any storage key. 
He's like, I give up. You just take it. We got the storage key. Very nice. Uh, oh. And a bottle of pee-pee up. I'm trying to figure out, is that a helipad on the roof? I don't know what that's supposed to be. It's got an X on it. I feel like it is. Alright, so now that we get the storage key, we can go over here. But this... Uh, oh, we can also... Let me grab that. Because now that we can use Rock Climb... We got a jar of full incense. Galactic Warehouse. No trespassing. There's nothing over here. Is this? I don't know. I thought that was the door on the side. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it there. Do you have the key? I don't know if you do or not, but a storage key is uh, safe with our guard in the front of the HQ. Huh? That's not what this is about? Doesn't look like there's anything else over here. The rust-encrusted door is locked. It appears to take a special key to open. Would you like to use the storage key? The rusty door creaked open, but the storage key snapped off inside the keyhole. And we got ourselves a dust stone. Oh, no, that's the same deal. All right, this is where we're gonna end the episode because on the next one, we're gonna be taking on the whole uh, Galactic HQ, which is a big old thing and save the three lake Pokemon. So. We're going to save that for the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe down below. We'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.